what's going on. But, oh, welcome to Experiment A. I think it's just a prototype or a demo of a game that's meant to be about... Oh, shit, it's a YouTube uh, scary pasta story. Hang on, let me... Does it escape? Close the game. It does. Fuck me. Alright, yeah, it was about... It's supposed to be a reference or tribute to the scary pasta EAS or emergency alert message. The link will be in the comments below if you want to know what the game is supposed to be inspired by or supposed to reference or tribute. So uh, it, it might be spoilers, but it'll be in the comments below for anyone that is curious. Now let's get back in the game. There's just like, it's full of skeletons and death and... And it could just, in summary, be like the Berserk manga. It's just death and shit everywhere. I still don't think I've, like, gotten rid of my mouse. Oh, the mouse cursor vanished, so whatever. Also, there's apparently supposed to be puzzles in here, so what would it? I never liked this old painting. It always creeped me out. Uh, there's something written on the plate. The fear of death had reached its apex. The minute men all bent over in surrender. Only my second hand still alive. 35 years into this war from death's drive. Okay. Let me turn up the volume just a little bit. The clock is passed down from generation to generation. It never keeps the time. Maybe I should fix it. Change the time. Nah. I don't need to change I wouldn't know what time to put it at currently. Old, reliable. Gotta catch them all! So just something about Pokemon. And my sister loves this crap. I could never get into it. Guess I lack imagination. Larry Harter! Genius... Genius... Uh, genius Rowling? I mean, I wouldn't say the author's a genius, but... Sure. Oh, shit. My head... Oh, itchy. God, I hate it when I wear this beanie and I get fucking itchy. Can't seem to get the thing to work. What's the time, though? Just a boring old vent. The hallway to upstairs is so dark. It always creeps me out running upstairs. Oh, you... oh hold on. I mean, there, there, there is this light. I mean, no, no. Natural light, really need to install blinds. Um, what am I supposed to be doing? Is there an actual way to get out of this room? I would hope so. I would think so. Maybe, oh, maybe, maybe 35 years. Oh, wait, this is probably the puzzle right here. Okay, let's see. I never liked this. Oh, okay, something other than light. My fear of death had reached its apex. The minute men all bent over. Bent over. Only my second hand still alive. 35. 35 obviously would be like the minute hand. But apex? I just think it would be something 35. Yes. Ah, uh, wait, that's the hour hand. Hmm. I believe it'd be 35, honestly, but... Second hand. Wait, what? What? Okay, this is gonna be a weird puzzle. Something about Apex. I don't know if eight, there's an Apex on a clock. I might have to do some research to see if Apex, the word itself, has a meaning or not. Didn't seem to do anything. Shit. Let me let me do some research on fucking clocks. Oh, I actually got it. Wow, fuck me. Turn off your TV immediately. Do not respond to familiar voices. And avoid contact with others. Do not look up at the ceiling. Turn all lights off. Turn off your TV immediately. Don't look at the ceiling. Oh. Well, it burped in my face. Okie dokie. Well, that...
puzzle was a bit annoying, but I, I, I sort of figured the, or at least my last theory that proved to be right was the apex of death. The hour hand was the apex of death. Um, while the third hand, which would basically be the second hand, or, you know, the seconds, not the minute hand, not the hour hand, or however much, how, whatever the fucking, the actual literal definition of a clock is, uh, was at the 35, you, you would have seen what the fuck I had it. And then the bending over backwards was on 15, not on 45. Or on the 3, not on the 9. It, it was trial and error for the most part. Um, but either way, okay, that, then yeah, additional sound. Car, car alarm walking past without a wave and free sounds. Yeah, thank you for playing. Okay, well that was a quickie. A very quickie. I'm not even half chub, but okay, that, that was that. I hope you enjoyed this short puzzle in your game about a scary pasta. If you want the real full thing of what was on that TV, it's probably in the video in the comments below. So if you're interested, put on some headsets, watch the video in the comments below, and of course turn off the lights and watch the video and tell me, hey, what did you think about that video and of course of this game? Maybe some more polish could go on this game to make it more immersive, but I think it was their first experience or ex first experiment and first take on making a game, so I'll I will I'll, I'll be I'll be lenient. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, comment, hit that subscribe button, become a full subscriber, hit that bell notification down below for updates on my videos, and thank you for watching. Until the next time. Mm.